Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. Behind me, you see the 4x4 Colorado Alto Elite King Size Fold Out. This is a king size footprint. Today, we're gonna to be doing a walk around. Um, we're gonna see how it opens, see how it goes together, and uh, we're gonna see if we can get some a little bit more comfortable with it before we take it up on the trail. Right now, the 4x4 Colorado Alto Elite is all aluminum frame now so was it last year's model was not aluminum frame they've made some upgrades to this tent and uh, the quality is just insane so come with me let's do a walk around and in future videos we're going to show you the practical uses and mountainous camping that this tent can actually do but right now it's sitting on the extrusion overland bed rack with the extrusion overland riser so it goes slightly above my cab which i'll show you shortly but let's get to it and do this walk around as when you look right here, these are the extrusion overland tent risers. Those raise me up two and a half inches. So this is attached to an extrusion overland bed rack. So these tent risers allow for me to sit a little bit above my cab in order to make sure the rear of the tent is level with the truck bed all right y'all so we're going to do a quick walk around so you can see it with the truck and then we're going to go ahead and unfold it this is enough this is a fully aluminum shell looks pretty good um very high quality i wanted something that was black on black uh this is oh, it's basically perfect this is exactly what the look i was going for all right all right we're gonna go ahead and open it up so in order to do that you got two latches one on each side so you just pull this down undo that one pull this side down and undo this one. Now I'm short, so don't laugh at me if I fall off or something. Like that. <laughs> you got your ladder. Right. So we got those, these bars up here, right? So those keep that rain fly off to the side. And of course, Jess is up here. Cool. It's got full LED lighting. Yeah, it is. You get a lot of room. So just for comparison, I'm up here now. Uh, I've got plenty of headspace. Oh of wow, course. they have a light here. Here, it comes with the LED light. That's, that's nice. I've got it hooked into a, a uh, just a solar little power bank, and you can. It's got a couple different settings. It's little, but it actually makes a oh, difference. You, have some... you can put your phone, right. your iPad in here. It's got the AC or heat port that you can run your diesel mm -hmm. heater to. You can put this up too. You got your side windows. 
And show this them. is actually pretty nice. What and it they? comes with the uh, anti-condensation mat underneath here. What is that? So this is an anti-condensation mat. Uh, that keeps away the condensation so it doesn't get moldy, mildewy in here. That's under there. If you lay back, it's got a skylight so you can see the stars, even if it's raining. Um, and this has that um, plastic over it on the outside. So even if you, uh, if it's raining, it still won't come through mm -hmm. and it's still effective as a mosquito net. <laughs> so that's pretty cool. And of course you got the side windows that you can roll up and you have extra springs in there that you can actually you know prop these windows up as well or you have the ability to roll these up so now the question how we can how we can lift kinsley <laughs> yeah we're way. gonna have to work on how we're gonna yeah. get the dog in here um but if you look here this is that blackout material so you can actually sleep during the day that's why this tent is a little heavier is due to the material right so extremely high quality here um, obviously it's really well built these seams look really really nice this is reinforced for heat specifically so it's heat resistant it's not going to melt or burn or any of that kind of jazz it's very comfortable inside the ladder is really, really nice. Um, you should not, don't trans, transit down the ladder for what I'm doing. So you should always go backwards. My favorite part is how it hinges. And I'm gonna show you why. Jess is up there chilling. This is why. So if you're putting this on something tight and you're afraid it's going to come back and hit something, it won't because of the way this hinges. It almost just goes up and down. It actually doesn't go back and forth. The only thing that tilts back slightly is this. I don't know if you guys seen. This is a roof rack on top. So that roof rack is good to hold any kind of luggage, canoes, bikes, whatever you may have up there as well. Comes with the ladder bag. And then of course it comes with uh, some extra hardware in here for everything. So I know this was just a quick uh, walk around and how everything is looking. We're gonna give it some practical use when we get to the mountain. Wanted you to see it on the truck, how it looks kind of away from the truck. Really good looking tent, really high quality. It came here packaged extremely well. It's easy uh, to fold out. So let's just see how easy it is to fold back up. All right, all right, everyone. So we did our walk around. So we're gonna go ahead and put this back up. Pull the bungee. Put the bungee back up on the side. Just keep in mind. This is our first time doing this. Some trial and error. We need to release the inside here.
right? <laughs> Is that a zipper sticking out? <laughs> no, dang it. Well, we almost got it right. Yeah. We'll pull it back up. So that's the gist of it. That's how you close it. I need to pull it back up and stick that back in because it's going to rain. So that is the gist of it. Uh -uh. How to get Stay. it back down. Yeah, just the zipper. Yeah, that should be good. Thanks for watching. We're going to get this sucker on the trail and we're going to actually show you the practical use of it. But great quality. 4x4 Colorado did a great job with their uh, quality control on these. And uh, let's see how it does in the mountains. Thanks for watching.